Uh, since I guess I got the egg too? Yeah, I gotta turn all this stuff in. I thought you're a fool for seeking out Mervail. A fool in love with death. Now, I don't know. Still, you've delivered this coast from the terrors that long held sway here. We may now find some respite, and that's more than any of us could have hoped for. But please, consider this. What have you become when even nightmares fear you? Alright. Oh! Man, I'll be back. Hold on a second. I gotta get rid of some of this stuff. Oh, let's do the ice now. Uh, thank you. I need to sell. Ah, uh, throw a stash. Oh shoot! Zoom out. Quite the lady killer, aren't you? That singing squid didn't stand a chance. Knew it from the first time I saw those sharp peepers of yours. Pirates notwithstanding, I thank you behalf of all the fallen brethren of the waves now that the final cadence has been played no one need remember Mervale's song just gonna forget her like that huh piety's raised chevron's barricade not that i was likely to ever make the trip inland but it was nice to have the dream hang on a moment got a stray thought seeking safe harbor Quiet is one to watch your own back, so she'd never cut off an escape route from possible trouble inland. The cunning witch must be able to lower that barricade from the other side, somehow. Damn me. I didn't think it possible. All these souls Mervale and her brood have consumed over the years. You've done right by those that are dead. And by those who still might live. Why would piety go and cut us off from the interior? Thankfully, I don't have any need to know what that witch thinks. But I reckon you'll work it out. Once you've lowered Chevron's barricade for us, of course. Farewell. Alright, so... Maroon Mariner optional. I mean optional. I'm gonna do it. surprised if you hadn't recognized me. Yes, tis I, Captain Cinnamon Fairgraves, wave tamer, pirate bane, and conveyor of civilization to barbaric lands. So, what am I doing here, apart from blowing my own bugle? I'm marooned, languishing, thanks to a pair of pretty blue eyes. Stuck fast in the filthy mud of Rayclast, thanks to one sultry little slave girl. I liberated her from the flesh pits of Trathos, and she repaid me in full with sleight of hand and swift feet. Turned the coat of my first mate, took my hard-earned ore flame, and with it the wind out of his sails. Find my ore flame, I beg of you. Till I feel its warmth again, I'm trapped here, high and dry, till the sun is my setting. I think I already found it. All flame, my blessed damn it, all flame. You're welcome. Oh, you want your moon of firelight now, do you? Unfortunately, necessity is what it is, 
And for the All Flame to give life, it must first be kindled with life. And since suitable kindling is in short supply around these parts, I have little option but to make do with what I have. Namely, you. That's frustrating. I feel like that should have been more difficult, but obviously I'm a pro POE uh, veteran at this point. <laughs> Sorry, get out myself. Fairgraves was a good man. Fine explorer. He opened the door to many a new world, for better or for worse. Usually for worse when it came to the natives. There's some peace in the knowledge that he now rests where he should. Let's not speak of Fairgraves again, shall we? He was an inspiration to many. It would be a shame to spoil a good hero. So you're gonna use that. I think that's all of it, right? That is that hundred percent? Cool. Ah. No brainer. Oh, I have one more for that. Okay, after taking no passive skill in this cluster to select a minion offense mastery bonus. I need one more skill, I guess. Okay, cool. Oh, yeah. One hour and 46 minutes. All right. Dead monkeys. All the variations in the areas. What caves, jungles, birds chirping?
Oh yes, let's do it! Yeah, get it! I can't go in the water. It's probably like four inches deep right there. They can't handle the heat or the cold. I don't think you meant that apology. Woods. Trying to zigzag pattern. Oh, right, I get everybody. encampment. Oh, found it. Hold on, got a fish. Doing what I'm doing. to the forest we go or forest encampment sorry found it I don't know if I'll get any sleep tonight I'm trying. Okay. Oh, it's the player. Oh, there's chickens. Can I kick the chicken? Oh, I guess not. It's not Fable. All right, time to collect our stuff. I am bruised. I hunt more. Hunt to feed my people. You are not a friend to us. You need to run faster than boar. They fall from trees, try to swarm over you like fleas. Their chieftain will stand back when he beats his chest. Bark is worse than bite. Ah, well, PvP action, huh? SO7 low level dueling. Ah, not right now. Travel far. Look 
recognize it. A survivor, just like Aina. That is my name, Exile, Aina. In my native tongue, it means lone fighter. That is what Aina was for many years. But it is dangerous now to fight alone. Too dangerous, even for the mighty Aina. We are in the final days of this world, Exile. That, I am sure. We survivors must unite, prepare for the end, and delay its arrival as long as we can. For that, we will need supplies, weapons, shelter, food. The others here do not understand me the way you do. Meet me in the riverways, and Aina will explain what must be done. You want to know Aina's past? That is Aina's business. No one else's. They were the first survivors. The first ones showed my people that to win, you must outlast. They left this world long ago to seek other survivors. But they will return. And when they do, I will join them in the Great Grove. And you will join Aina, yes? Yes. seen many an exile come and go into the forest or into the ground you seem different somehow different good different bad it's hard to tell at this stage the name is Eremir for now you have the benefit of my doubt those bandits you've encountered out there they're the dregs of Oriath and with any foul broth the nastiest chunks bubble to the surface. The lords of Larceny, Oak, Creighton, and Alira, the self-appointed monarchs of the forest, Creighton in the east, Alira in the west, Oak in the north, and this village, this tribe, we pay their taxes. I would never venture to say that life in Raytlast is easy, but with those three gone, well, Living here might just become possible. The Asmiri. The culture that descended from the Asmirian mountains and founded the Eternal Empire so long ago. Not that these people have any understanding of their lineage. Their history, identity, all but destroyed in the Cataclysm. These Asmiri took in a disowned son of Oriath. Fed me, healed me. To repay my debt, I've taken in the orphans of a dead empire. Grust is the strong right arm of this tribe. No man hunts better, and no man could do more to protect the ones he loves. I've read about Chevron of Umbra and what she did to the warden at Axiom. You did well to end Brutus's sorry existence. But Chevron's barricade, that's sad news indeed. There is little enough freedom in Rayclast as it is, but to be stranded on that dismal coast, I pity the... I've read about Chevron of Umbra and what she did to the warden at Axiom. You did well to end Brutus's sorry existence. But Chevron's barricade. Apologize for that. News indeed. There is little enough freedom in Rayclast as it is, but to be stranded on that dismal coast, I pity the exile. Alf. I embraced the patronage that High Templar Dominus offered my struggling museum. I took his favor and conducted his research into the thaumaturgical arts practiced within the Eternal Empire. I wish I'd known then what I know now. That I was pandering to the warped dreams of a madman. Fare you well.
You and me, we are the same. We dream big. We find new places. We do not tell stories. Stories are told about us. I learn the words, the ways of Aria. You listen to me and not pig heads like Bruce. Then you will live to find more new places. The road. It runs east and west of here. To the west, it passes the bandit woman's camp, then turns south to the sea. But you say it is now blocked. I have seen a strange thing in the rock by that south path, like one of Grust's carvings, but of stone. You should go look at it. What has been closed might be opened again. Many exiles come this way. Eremir is not like them, not like you. He is an old man with many stories. He teaches us words that you can understand. He teaches we as Miri to be strong, not in our arms and legs like Grust, strong in our heads. Grust is the big man in the tribe. All do what Grust says, but his spear goes limp when faced with the eight legs. Keeper of the spirit. Are you a kind exile like Irmi? He is good to us, helps us. You stay and help us too, yes? A beast hunts us in her dreams. A great white beast, tortured and maddened by bad men. A long time gone. She will come here one night to tear, crush, and eat. Her pain tells her to. Find the white beast and end her pain before she shares it with us. Iremir was a wise man in Oria. He is our wise man now. Hear him. You will learn much. If you do not hear, you will likely die. Grust does what he thinks is right. And in Grust's dream, he is never wrong. Silk knows more than others think. He watches. He learns. Look between the words, and you'll see the truth in Silk's stories. The forest children are ill. Once they drank from fruit, ate nuts and berries. Now they drink blood, eat brain and heart. This land is in a nightmare from which it cannot wake. Alright, looks like we got all the quests. There's the four for now. When we can go left, we can go right. The old fields. Let's go! Off to get the white beast! Probably should change my uh, skills and, or spells or whatever they get called. But. You guys need some skeletons in your life. skeletons. Oh, 
I don't really need that, but I'll grab it anyway. Okay. If I can use any of this. I need any of that. I'm better there. No, we're gonna go over here. The crossroads. All right. Oh, we'll with this white beast. That's what they call me. See what I did there? I am the white beast. Sorry. Couldn't help myself. Too easy. Ooh, a little poison action down here, it looks like. Portal scrolls. Gentlemen, this way. Oh, that doesn't look good. I think I found it. White beast. Done, son. Oh, that was easy enough. The old fields. You know, we're gonna go exploring even though we just beat it. Yeah, you know, I don't appreciate that. I'm trying to do stuff here. Oh, got wrecked. Oh, man. I feel like this should mean something. You know what? That's my screenshot right there. Got the white beast. Sure did. All right. We gotta pick one. X. Overwhelm 20% physical damage reduction. I'm not sure that was the right choice. One point left. That's interesting. Gotta get the minions up, bro. Alright, we are definitely 
Gotta screenshot this bad boy. In case anyone's wondering, I'm clipping the whole thing. Alright, cool. Now let's go somewhere at some point. The crossroads. That's left. Bandits. Let's go kill some bandits. It wasn't raining two seconds ago. Stink hole? Is that what it says? Stink moil. I think my version was better. Stink hole. Oh, hello, electric guy. Not dead. All right, he fell standing up. Get that, right? Here we go. Oh, I'm gonna die. Woohoo! All right. What's this? I want that. since the black storm in the northern ranges not since the nightmares began violent and twisted night terrors they whisper to us tempt us threaten us beguile us they promise terrible things in return for even more terrible acts my husband Daenerys went to Alliston to find a doctor who might help he should have been back yesterday I fear for him I fear for all of us It has been a little over a week since the black storm. My husband has not returned, and sickness now sweeps through our village. Many have died, and those who have lived have changed. These were folk we once called neighbor and friend. Now they limp and stagger through the night, their deformities as grotesque as the madness in their eyes. Get out of here with that nonsense. Oh, look. Disturb them in their sleep. I'm sure they appreciate that. Sorry, guy. Where's this one go? Felshire Ruins. Three Lunar 
very gone now since it all began. Perhaps I am the only one who still looks upon one eyes, who remembers her name. Soon, I will be gone, and the moon will go on alone. My husband has returned, and he hunts for me. My dead husband hunts me. Horror, too, and my uncle. Corpses rise and walk and feed. My girls, they walk now and feed. God has forsaken us. Lunaris is my witness. Tonight, I return to my family. Probably should have found the third one. Ravalo called out while the others skulked and muttered in the darkness. Colin went to them, arms open, welcoming. The nightmares told her to. My uncle tried to stop her. Ravalo crushed his skull with his smith's hammer. I barred the doors and windows, but they screamed like monkeys and beat themselves bloody trying to get in. I had no choice. I took my two youngest and fled through the cellar, following the tunnel to the mill. All we can do is hide and hope. God help us. No bleeding action. Yep, that was too fast. Alright, let's go uh, over here. I could learn a thing or two here. Inquisitor, if you attempt to transmogrify a virtue gem without the proper mental preparation, you will be a puppet master working strings made of vipers. Remember, these gems are phantasms in crystalline form, alive with volitions inscrutable. Master conscious dreaming 
as I instructed you. Your death would mean little to me, Malagaru. It's what your demise could unleash that concerns me. Malachi. Love it. Okay. I'm going further that way. Maybe the key to really enjoying a game like this is to make sure that they've had 10 years to sort it out. Shabby jerkin. I haven't had like a a beautiful jerkin. They're all shabby. Oh man, I can tell you guys right now, wife and kid have been at wife and kids have been out of town. So I don't know as if I'll be able to talk as much as I normally do because I tend to like to talk loud when I have my headphones on. I should know better, but I don't. My wife comes out. Hey, can you be quiet? Because I'm being really loud. She's a good sport. Oh my goodness! Just nuking these guys. Too much clutter. Too much clutter. What do you mean too much clutter? Oh, I should probably have gone to town. I'm sure there's a guy in here I need to go. Fuck that guy. Where's that necromancer? Oh, he's dead. Good. Yeah. Is there a guy in here I'm supposed to be killing? Too much clutter. Yeah, but it's got to be good, right? I'm not gonna use that. Let's put that there. Who knows? I sure don't. But I know I'm not gonna wear that big ass helmet. Oh. This can't be good. He appears to have, uh. disconnected his head. Oh, there's the second level. Uh, let's see. Did that one. Minions. Yep. I said minion tree. Where? Uh. Oh, okay. I thought we were gonna go down here. Sure. It's never good when there's nobody over here. Kill him. I'm dealing with that. Get out of here with your silly self.
Oh, that's neat looking. Too much clutter. Cool. Too much clutter. You're too much clutter. I didn't pick anything up. Dang, it's a big area. How do I get there? Can I walk over that? I feel like somebody big is coming. This transmutation device to you, Inquisitor Maligaro. The recognition of your devotion to our sublime art. May it be the chariot that conveys your dreams into reality. Maligaro, the Waterge Laureate to the Empire. Ooh, a gift. I got a beautiful gem. After a creation of Melagaro's called the Baleful Gem. It's nearby and it's something that heartless bitch must never get her hands on. You have it already. Thank innocence. All right, take it to the Esmeri village by the river. I'll meet you there, for my days with the Ebony Legion are done. Piety was after a creation of Melagaro's. Hey, okay. Travel the forest and gentlemen. Let's go. Enchantment. Encampment. What do I got? What do I got? Oh my god, three hours. I don't know if that's three videos. It's at least two. The Oriathan girl. She is alive. She wants to stay with us, not to go back to her people. I say we take your traitor's heart to the chief. Ask that the warriors in black leave us be. They sleep less, but no more, thanks to you. Helena gave me these. Use it or cast it away. I do not care. I have no time for Helena's breed of peace. Yeah, I'm taking it anyway. We are Azmer. You are not. Eremir is not. Life was good when it was just Azmer. Yina thinks she knows the spirit that it talks to her. She talks to herself. Crush is kind of a dick. Silk is no hunter. Silk scares children with stories at fire time. That eight leg he wears, he did not kill it. Found it in the forest, dead of age. I would like to see Silk face live eight leg one day. See him wrapped up for lunch. Rocks and water. They move and live like monkey and viper. They die like monkey and viper too. There is no heart to see, but there is a heart to stab. 
if you can find it with your spear. I have no use for Helena's kind of peace. This is our home. We hunt, we grow, we build. Your kind in the forest kill, steal, and burn. Soon they will take it all, leave us no food. Then we must move, leave our home. Going? <laughs> the day has dawned, exile. I like Yina. She thinks bigger than this place. She knows there is more to life than hunting and growing more. There is spirit. I like this new Oriathan woman. She has new stories. Not like Eremir, who only speak of that which is dead and dust. Yes, I have many questions for this Helena. Great white beast is dead. Then make a tale. A song to sing of the mighty exile and their teacher, Silk the Wise. Many will be impressed, yes? The white beast's spirit is at rest. No more pain. Take this in thanks from me and from the suffering animal that you have helped. The spirit is strong in Fell Shrine. You touch the stones, you will Here you go, party guy. They spoke to me, those stones. Told me to take their altar and to find the hand of a good man. He lived in that church, as you call it. The altar is his, and it will wake when he... Sorry, I let the dog home. out. You understand? You could find the good man. Bring me his hand. When the spirit of the altar awakes, I will share it with you. I promise. Elena is healing. I make sure of that. But you want to know if you can trust her. I see her spirit. It was born good and needs work to keep it that way. Much like yours. There is land that has forgotten the spirit. Some man taught the rocks and water a different dream. Now the rocks and water think they are man. I gave the Ebony Legion my faith and my loyalty, and it offered me nothing but fear and death in return. Thank you for freeing me from both. I had nothing to give you but my gratitude and my knowledge. I know you have no use for the former, so let's hope the latter makes up for it. Piety led us into that wretched place in the hopes of finding a device named simply the Spike. Fashioned by Inquisitor Melagaro, it was said to enable the injection of Calibric Extantia into living flesh. Calibric Extantia being the corrupt energies locked within Virtue Gems. We couldn't find the spike, yet we met its most successful application. The Blackguards will never stop pursuing someone they consider a traitor. I'm a danger to everyone around me and not long for this world if I can't find a place to hide. Based on what the Asmeri have told me of this region, the Dread Thicket is rumored to be a terribly dangerous and wild place. The Blackguards will never search there. Let's travel separately to avoid detection, and I'll meet you there. According to his notes, the Baleful Gem was a byproduct of Melagaro's attempts to enhance the already formidable qualities of Virtue Gems. It was an abject failure, yet Melagaro wasn't one to waste his atrocities. By combining the Baleful Gem with the venom extracted from one of his arachnid subjects, he brewed something called Black Elixir. He proudly proclaimed it to be the most potent poison in existence until it was stolen by a man named Victario. It was rather entertaining to read Melagaro's intentions for Victario once he caught the man. Twisted, yet I can't fault the Inquisitor's creativity. Melagaro had an assistant, a man named Raulo. If Melagaro's records spoke truly, Raulo offered himself freely as a test subject. With the spike, Melagaro injected Raulo with a high dose of Calibric Extantia, thus gifting the poor man with both endless life and horrific deformity. In honor of his sacrifice to Melagaro's work, the Inquisitor gave Raulo a new name, Fidelitis. I thought Dominus was a leader of vision, of purpose. 
The man who would resurrect the Eternal Empire. In truth, Dominus is only after power. The black thaumaturgical power locked within the Virtue Gems. He wishes to create a new empire, one in his own image. I drank every night to try and wipe that image from my mind. It's still there. Our expedition made camp in the Western Forest while Piety took a few men through the pass to Axiom Prison. She was after the research notes of one Chevron of Ombra, a witch who devoted herself to the study of transfiguration during the latter days of the Eternal Empire. Piety returned alone and disturbingly happy with her findings. I've learnt that when Piety is happy, misery is soon to follow for everyone else. The Blackguards will never stop pursuing someone they consider a traitor. I'm a danger to everyone around me and not long for this world if I can't find a place to hide. Based on what the Asmeri have told me of this region, the Dread Thicket is rumored to be a terribly dangerous and wild place. The Blackguards will never search there. Let's travel separately to avoid detection and I'll meet you there. Go with courage. I have story for you. A good story, but not finished. I go into Eight Legs Forest in Southwest. Meet the mother of all Eight Legs. We fight. Big fight. From sunrise to sunset. I stick my best spear in mother's eye and return to village. Must not stay away too long. Must protect my people. Now my best spear still in mother's eye. Eremir said to leave it there, that my spear is a thing made for dark sights, whatever that be. No, I want it back. But Mother Eightleg would smell me from far off, catch me by surprise. She doesn't know your smell. So you go, get my spear, finish good story with good ending. I'll cut it there. I'll wrap this up. Alright, as always, guys. Thanks for watching. Do I do the like, comment, subscribe? I don't know how that goes. I don't know how all the YouTubers say it. I'm not going to say it. You do what you want to do. I said it, I guess. Maybe I'll say it later. I'll figure it out. As always, thanks for watching. You guys got something for me? Let me have it. I'm all ears. I'm here to learn. I really do enjoy this game. Later.